In this video I'm going to show you how I did the character design on Captain Dodo. It's a commission for a client and I had to make a cartoon character out of a, a vulture and make him likable. Welcome to Stave Draws. I'm Stave, a Dutch illustrator and animator. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I made the character design for Captain Dodo. And it's for a commission for a, a client. And he has um, a sanctuary for predatory birds. And he wanted a, a cartoon character from one of his vultures. And, you know, the challenge was to, you know, make the vulture or Captain Dodo a likable character and I went to the sanctuary and fortunately I could uh, film and I was also inside the cage when he was feeding the vultures that was a kind of scary but very interesting and then you can you know really see how these birds move and how their anatomy works so in this video, I'm just going to show you uh, the process of how I created uh, Captain Dodo. In order to understand a character or a bird or the vultures, I took all of these um, videos and I also took some pictures of the vultures. And especially inside, you know, you cannot really sketch them out because it is too dangerous. But I got a lot of footage and I used that to study the vultures and I just did a lot of sketches of the real thing. And you know, if you, you're doing cartoon design, it always derives from the original. You first need to find out how the anatomy works, you know, how the posture is of the character and you know how long uh, the wings of a vulture because they're very wide and when i studied the video i just saw how they moved and they you know really hop around and they're a little bit clumsy but you know i had to make this character uh, cute and you know, when you look at the face of a vulture, they're not really cute. They're quite menacing. So that was a challenge, you know, to still keep the personality of the bird. And uh, I just did a lot of uh, sketches, you know, first exploring and studying, you know, how the structure of the face works. I made more sketches than I usually do because birds are a bit difficult to draw and especially in cartoons because you know you need to capture it in a few lines and especially the the beak you know looks different from every other uh, position so I first did all uh, the sketches of the real thing and then later on I just started to make more of a cartoon and when you draw over and over again you explore the character and you find uh, different things from uh, all the studies I've done before and then you can make it into a cartoon character and just try out different poses and you know find the character you want to portray I tried out some different uh, characteristics so I made him a little bit goofy and you know see if that works and tried some other hats because uh, the story behind Captain Dodo is that it is a kind of Jack Sparrow but then as a bird. I also tried out some different designs on the color of Captain Dodo. But, you know, I was also looking at old paintings from the Golden Age. And there you see that all the notables have these, you know, colors, some white colors. They're round and just played around with that, if that could be incorporated into the character. These are actually uh, griffin vultures. And 
For the design, you know, uh, if you work in color, you need to find some other attributes, you know, to make it a little bit more interesting. Otherwise, it would be just one gray bird. I also played around with, you know, uh, putting some pants on the bird and uh, different hats and also uh, a bandana. And I also looked at uh, some pirates and I just incorporated that into uh, the sketches and when I was finished with all of the sketches of uh, Captain Dodo I just picked five different designs and I just numbered them and that I sent to the client and you know that's a good conversation piece because then you can you know discuss on what they like about the character and you know, you can make up the final design of the character by picking out, you know, uh, maybe the head of number one, the hands of number four. And in that way, you can, you know, come to the final design of, of the character. And this is the final design of Captain Dodo. So this is how I did the character design for Captain Dodo. In the next video, uh, I will do the inking and also the coloring, but I'm going to do it in vectors. And I use the app Adobe Fresco, so stay tuned. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you like it, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit that notification bell, because each time I upload a new video, you get a notification. Drawing is fun and practice makes perfect. See you next time. Doodles!